Hi, um, my name is Linda, and I do some um, Native pers Perspective updates. Um, I'm half Cherokee and I'm half white. I was raised by Cherokee Indians. Um, the question right now I have gotten is, how do Native Americans feel about their Second Amendment right? And I can tell you that most Native Americans believe that the Second Amendment was created to protect slavery and take the land from the Native Americans. Now I'm trying to update this to about our era now, uh, of which we call civilization. I don't believe we're very civilized at this point. However, this is where we stand. The Indians are getting armed. I know they are. They may deny it. Um, I suggest everyone get armed. I don't care if you're a Republican, a Democrat, a greenie, a bluey, a yellow, a whoever you are, if you're inside North America, you better get armed because what's about to happen, I know in, in, in my belief and in my heart, a revolution is just full circle and we're coming full circle again, but this circle now is going to encompass all of you people who were like the Indians, you're just going to be put in with us and we're going to have to fight the empire together. So we all need to get along with all races and all cultures and all religions so we can do this because we can outsmart them. They do have more weaponry than we do and that's why they're trying to keep they're saying oh your weapons are for deer hunting. Oh no, the preamble to the Constitution clearly states that a well-armed militia and the people are to protect us from tyranny. So we need to do what was suggested so we don't fall back. Well, we're already shackled. I mean, let's just not get shackled so far that our children and, and our unborn grandchildren and all of those are slaves forever and ever. We can outthink them now. We have broke out of the box. A lot of us have. We have turned the TVs off. I haven't watched TV and I couldn't tell you when. Um, and that's remarkable to some people. But once you get away from the fluoride, the drugs, the GMOs, um, the TVs, the propaganda, things happen and it's magical. And so right now, yeah, I hate to say it, arm yourself. Because even if it's just a posturing, we will win. And that's my Native American perspective on the Second Amendment. Peace.